I'm so tired, but really good workout. Three sets each exercise. And I did six exercises, 10 reps, 10 to 12. Um, you can increase the difficulty by adding weights or slowing down your tempo. But obviously making sure you are using correct form, form over weights for sure. Today I kind of slowed down my reps a bit since I was doing moderate to heavy weight. Um, so yeah, but I'm beat now. I am going to do 30 minutes of cardio. I'm looking at the Stairmaster. I might split it and do 15 on there and then 15 on the walk just because my legs are gonna be so beat, but they're gonna feel so good after. Sorry about the music. I'm gonna try to talk fast, but um, I'll figure out what cardio I'm gonna do. But um, it's one o'clock and when I get home, I'm gonna go ahead and eat my first meal, breakfast. I'll go ahead and do that and then I'll see you guys when I'm at home. guys what I what is in my water jug but this is what I've been using it is the transparent labs hydrate electrolyte powder it's so good this is the peach mango flavor but I drink about one to three scoops a day um, just depending on how I'm feeling some days I need this I try to drink this every day for the most part I do, but some days I just don't. But this is my favorite. It's definitely helped me stay hydrated. It has magnesium in it as well. So it will help you get some nice sleep. It'll help with like cramps if you're on your cycle. Um, and there's just, this is the best ever. So not sponsored or anything. This is truly my opinion on this product. I really, really like it. Um, and yeah. Okay, I'm about to get started on my potatoes. So I'm gonna do the quick little potato hack. Um, if you haven't seen it, you chop up your potatoes and then you just put them in the microwave, like in a microwave safe bowl and put them in there for like five minutes, depending on how many you have. I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure it depends on how many you have in there, but I'm just using like a little bag of the um, gold potatoes. I'm gonna chop them up, pop them in the microwave, let them soften and then I'm gonna pop them on the stove. a little shaken espresso drink okay so I have my coffee here obviously if you have you know if you can use like espresso shots that would be a lot better than this but it's still gonna taste pretty similar you know and then I picked up this Brown sugar cinnamon, it's sugar free from Home Goods. I originally was gonna use this in my matcha. I tried this in it and I did not like it. I think it's the cinnamon kind of overpowers the matcha in this, so I didn't care for it. Maybe I put a little too much. I really didn't measure, I just kind of poured a little bit in now. But um I thought it would be I thought it would taste better in a coffee. So I'm just going to 
do that instead. I also have like decaf coffee, not this one. This was my last like caffeinated pod, but I have decaffeinated pods in there. So I just like the coffee taste. I really don't think coffee does anything to me. Um, maybe like espresso shots would, but like I'm usually like an iced coffee girl and there's not that much caffeine in that is either. So honestly, I just like the, co um, the coffee taste. So I'm gonna use a container that has a lid. You can use like a shaker cup as well. But this is the zero sugar one. Um, I'm gonna just do like a couple first and then a couple cupfuls and I'll see how I like the taste. If I want more, I'll just put more in it. We're gonna go ahead and pour that. Okay, I'm just making a mess. Be like me. I'm wasting so many glasses right now. Okay. I'm gonna pour that in there. Do you guys do that or is it just me? Finished product. Can't wait to eat. I hope you guys got some inspiration from this video. That's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Food is fuel. You need to eat in order to grow or lose, okay? And lose fat, grow or lose fat. So don't be afraid to put nutritious food in your body. And um, yeah, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye.